Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Wednesday, so it's what you're working on Wednesday. Today I'm working on a new whip. Um, I have no idea what it's going to be. <laughs> I had this here under my stash for a while. I almost hit my shoulder face. Um, it was in this area somewhere, right there. <laughs> it was gifted to me by one of my friends, Phyllis, um, because at the time... I really wanted some of this yarn and uh, the closest place to me that sold it was Joann's and it was almost an hour away. But every time I went, this color was sold out. And um, so she bought me two balls and sent it to me. And uh, now my local Hobby Lobby sells it. It's only a 20 minute drive from here, about 24 minutes. Um, but now they sell this kind of yarn. But anyways, <laughs> it's Lion Brand Ice Cream Cotton Blend. It's really pretty. It's called Rainbow, <laughs> as if you can tell. Let's see, everyone's the stuff. It is 225 yards. It's a size 4, but it's uh, on the thinner side, I think. I think it's closer to a 3. Uh, it's 47% cotton, 53% acrylic. So I have two balls of this, and it's been sitting there forever, and I've been wanting to use it. So um, last night I was watching some TV with Jesse, and I was trying to look on Ravelry and stuff to see what I wanted to make. And I couldn't find any patterns that I either had enough yarn for or that I wanted to make. Because together, how many did I say? Yeah, together it's two or 400 and... 50 yards of the yarn <clears throat> so I just grabbed my trusty dusty J hook <laughs> and um, started making like a mesh thing <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing it's pulling too see all the yellow and purples are here and then like the rainbowy colors are over here that's bothering me I told Devin I might have to rip it out and uh, start again but I'm just making a mesh um, thing i thought about making one of those um shrugs with it like a mesh one like a cocoon so i might make this really long and uh put in you know most of the yarn in it if it'll fit you know and um make a shrug you know we put the two corners together for armholes just to make like a meshy shrug thing <laughs> or i don't know i haven't i didn't even think about it i just i wanted to make meshy something and i wanted to use this rainbow yarn so i just went ahead and started using it and um i'm going from there so it's just a mush so it's double crochets and then a chain two skip two chains and double crochet just across <laughs> that's all i'm doing and i have no idea what it's going to turn out to be but it is really bothering me that like the pastel colors are right there and the brighter colors on that side because i wanted it to be you know mixed up rainbow like the ball so i might have to rip it out and just start my string a little bit further in so that the colors are spread out a little bit better i don't know i don't know if i want to rip it out though i don't know i might just go and see what happens <laughs> maybe it'll pull and do some kind of weird zigzag thing or something i don't know but i'm trying to figure it out i just wanted to use this yarn i thought about making amigurumi with it but i couldn't think of what to make because of the colors i was thinking like a unicorn maybe or um i don't know i don't know i'm just messing with yarn <laughs> so that's what i'm working on today i'm just making a mesh thing <laughs> i did uh make some little amigurumis yesterday but i proceeded to lose one because it was really small it was like that big i made it for jesse and now we can't find it <laughs> but um i also made him a little um it's supposed to be a lobster but it looks more like a crawdaddy or a mud bug um but he loves it so i'll be sharing those with you guys in the next um no catch name episode and yeah, so that's what I'm working on today. I do have a few other things I need to get to working on. Jesse just sneezed to hurt him. Um, he's, his allergies have been acting like crazy. I just gave him some allergy medicine. I'm feeling better, by the way. I had people ask, and I, I guess it was just allergies that one day. I had like a sore throat, but now it's fine. And it was only for that morning, so I don't know. I guess it was allergies. <laughs> Yesterday, I did have a migraine headache really bad. I laid on the couch most of the day, so that's why I didn't put out any videos on either of my channels because I had a migraine. <laughs> but uh, luckily, it finally, it, I had it all day long. And it finally eased up about 7.30 last night. I was finally able to watch TV and stuff. Um, that's when I started working on this. Because my head hurt so bad I couldn't even watch TV. Jesse had the TV on and was watching it. but And normally I watch like on my phone or on my laptop. So he can watch whatever he wants to watch. Um, and I couldn't even do that. Because I, I tried and my eyes kept going crossed. And it was hurting so bad. And I kept feeling like I was going to throw up. So I ended up just making like a pallet on the couch. And just laid there. And I snoozed on and off. Um trying to get the headache to break but anyways it finally did break i used to have migraines a lot when i was a teenager and really haven't had any in forever in years and then that one just happened randomly so yeah it happens but anyways i am feeling better anyways what am i doing what's working wednesday i'm working on this mesh random thing <laughs> so leave, leave me some comments down below tell me what you guys are working on today 
and uh, feel free to leave any links or channel links or pattern links or anything like that down there so we can all check out um if you have any idea what i could make <laughs> i'm thinking about making one of those cocoon things i don't know but we'll see just let me know if you ever use this yarn let me know what you made with it because uh it's really pretty i want more of it i'd love to have enough to make something big with it but uh, I like it a lot. It's real pretty. They got other colors that are real pretty too. There's one that's like green and orange. That I really like it too. But uh, yeah. So let us know what you all are working on. And uh, so we can check out the patterns and stuff. And I'll see you guys in another video. <laughs> Bye guys.